In healthcare, you're faced with lots of difficult decisions, um, whether you're a clinician or a patient or anyone in policy or politics. And healthcare ethics and law really prepares you to, to understand all the aspects of those questions and the issues that are at stake, legally and ethically speaking. It's a very different thing to make a decision for oneself and to make a decision for lots of people. Studying healthcare ethics and law here has really taught me to distinguish between my own uh, feelings towards certain problems and actually dealing with it on a sort of more academic intellectual level and what is ethically and legally right. Things like abortion to end of life care to um, allocation of resources within the healthcare system to questions of people's health individually and as a society. It's reflecting on values and then finding appropriate sort of legal frameworks and ethical frameworks to deal with those situations. And obviously one important thing to remember in this field is that it's changing quite rapidly. Um, we have new technologies, we have new possibilities um, in medical treatment and they pose quite significant challenges to sort of traditional values that we have. One of the great things about um, studying here at the School of Law in Manchester is that the place is hugely interdisciplinary. So you get to tap into the expertise of people from all sorts of backgrounds, whether it's philosophy or law, and it's not just one particular field that's being covered. One of the projects I'm working on um, it looks at how to share medical data um, for sort of greater research into lifestyle diseases and problems that affect large portions of the society. Um, and the first reaction you might have is, oh, data sharing is really bad, or you might say this is a really great thing. But when you look at it more closely, it's far more difficult to reach such a conclusion because it's not a black and white situation. You need to weigh ethical issues, legal issues, and different interests against each other. And this is what studying healthcare ethics and law has prepared me for.